all right hi guys how are you guys doing as you can tell this is a very different setting from where you guys are used to seeing me from um the camera is wobbling hold on just a moment so apparently it wasn't working out how i had it at first but now we do all right how are you guys doing i apologize for the late upload as you can tell in my voice i wasn't feeling my best so that is why i am just now recording the video but by the time you guys will see this it'll be christmas eve so merry christmas eve for those of you that celebrated on the 24th and merry christmas um i hope that you guys were able to get things for your loved ones this year um any little gift any small gesture as long as it was with love given with love it's much appreciated always right <laughs> okay so let's go ahead and get started with you know calculating my paycheck so it's a part-time job get paid every bi-weekly so for this paycheck i was able to make 564 dollars so let me write it up here let me show you what I do with my check. So it's 564, right? So now I'm going to tell it where to go. And I like to start off with my tithe. So for my tithe, I'm going to do 10%. So that's going to be um, 56. So 56 minus 56 gives me 508. Moving on for gas, I'm going to do 50 minus 50. 458 groceries is going to get 100 minus 100 cart maintenance i'm just going to do 20 okay minus 20 we leave with those now which leaves me with 338 dollars with sinking funds so i'm gonna do christmas 100 yes i'm still putting for christmas because guys I am going to run today and get some last minute Christmas shopping done. All right, leaves me with 80 school envelope. I'm going to do 25. Birthdays, I'm going to do 20. Wait, hold on. This don't look right. <laughs> okay, 338, right? Minus 100. That's 238, right? Minus 25 minus 20 i was like how am i down to 35 dollars already impossible <laughs> okay now giving is gonna get 20 so minus 20 clothes is going to get 25 and let's see pets we're just gonna do 10 and last sinking fund envelope is family fund i'm gonna do 25 so 25, which leaves me with $113 for savings. Yay. So now that I told every single dollar where to go, it's time to figure out my breakdown. So let me go ahead and do that. Starting with tithe. So 50, five, six, and then a solid 50, a 100, a 20, another 100, a 20 and a five, a 20, another 20, a 20 and a 5, a 10, a 20 and a 5, and 100, 10, 1, 2, 3. Okay? All right, and now to make sure that the breakdown is correct, I'm going to add this to the calculator, and it should add to 564. So 3 100s is 300, 300 plus 250s, 100, plus 620s, 120, plus 220s, 210s, 20. Plus four fives, another 20. And four ones. Four. Equals 564, which means that this is correct. So now what I like to do is get my sticky note. And I write at the top how much I am going to withdraw, 564. And I basically go to the bank person. And I tell them I need to withdraw 564. And I need them in these denominations. And yeah. With that being said, I'm going to go get this and I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So I was able to get every single bill except for um, uh, the 50s. 
um they gave it to me in 220s and a 10 so that's okay so now that i have the bills here i'm gonna go ahead and put them in the little divider here that i have on the side i will leave a link down below where you can get this um a subscriber actually private messaged me on instagram and she was like let me hook you up this was only ten dollars i was like yes thank you so much you guys always come through for me and i appreciate that very very much so i will leave a link down below if you are interested in getting one of these okay with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Starting with my tithe. My tithe is going to get 56. So like I said, 20s and 10s. So 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 110, 120, 130, 140, on into groceries because gas i already got that out so here's my groceries envelope i have some change there in a dollar so i'm just gonna take out the spare change and put it into my jar and i'm gonna leave the dollar in here and just grab the 100 for groceries so that's a full 100 going in here all right Next will be my car maintenance one, and that one's going to get a 20. So it says here I already have 70. So 70 and 20, that leaves me with 90. So let me get a 20, and then I'm going to go ahead and count it. Add it on here. Okay, let's see. 50, 70, 85, 90. Okay, 90 into my car maintenance envelope. Okay, moving on to sinking funds. It would be my Christmas envelope. I've done some shopping, so I'm just going to leave what I have here. But I'm going to take out the coins. Okay. And it says there's 55 in here, but I am going to add 100. Because like I said, I am not done with Christmas shopping. I messed up on my dates. It's okay. So, let me let's set this down. Adding 100. So, now it should be 155. Okay. Now, let me get the 100. And then we're going to count it. All right. 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 5, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. All right. 155 for last minute Christmas shopping okay next is going to be my school envelope and this one sadly only has a dollar left because my kids had christmas parties and you know i gotta participate you know my kids into it so i'm gonna go ahead and boost it up and add 25 so now it should be 26 dollars so you can see the dollar right there and then a 20 and a 5 26 <laughs> I believe the next holiday that they will um, participate into needing goodie bags and stuff will be Valentine's Day. Right. Okay. All right. Moving on to birthdays. Birthdays. We just started this one. So there's only 10 in here. And we're going to add 25 because if you've been following me, you know, my eight-year-old was her birthday and we used up all that money to make her party. So now we're starting fresh. So now let's get a 20 and a 5, 20, 5, and then there's a 10, which leaves me with 35. Okay, next is my giving envelope. This one, I just like to get it and stuff it in there um, yeah. to bless others. There we go. Next would be my clothes envelope. This one, you know, I, I believe there's only 5 in here. Yes. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and add 25, so... Adding 25 now leaves me with 30. So you can see the 5 right there. So 20 and a 5 plus 5, 30. Okay. Next is my pet envelope. And it says that I have 15 here. And we're going to add a 10. 
So now that should be 25. So adding 10 and it should be 25. So let's just see really fast. 10, 15, 20, 25. Okay. Stuffing it right in there. And my last sinking fun envelope is family fun. And this one is getting 25. Oh, I need change. Oh, no. Okay, I got it. Let me see if savings has um, two fives I can borrow. Oh, uh, no. Okay. No worries. We're just going to have to get our own change, right? I believe Christmas has two fives. Oopsies. Things like this happen. So I'm getting it out of my Christmas one. Now let me get that right there. And we're just going to pretend like... <laughs> We just gonna pretend like nothing went wrong, right? That we go. Okay, there. Nothing went wrong. All right, now twenty-five. So twenty and a five. <laughs> Sometimes you know it happens. I really, really thought she gave me the change, but okay. All right. And my last envelope is my savings envelope, and here it is. Two weeks ago, I was able to only add 34 to it, but this week we are adding 113. So, I've got to pull this out. 113 plus 34 should be 147. So, 147. Now we're going to count to make sure that it is that all right let's go ahead and see if it's 147 100 oh 120 30 5 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 all right 147 okay guys i still have one more check on the 31st of this month so this month, you know, I am glad that I was able to get um, three checks. So, we shall see. I didn't really put in a lot of hours because uh, I did miss one day for each week. So, my hours are not that much, but it's okay. Because I love to think that a little goes a long way. So, don't worry. Um... It'll all come out. Let me go get my jar so we can put these in there. All right, here's my jar. It doesn't have that much coins, but that's okay. Let's see. you guys with that being said that is it for today's video like i said if you are new to my channel hit that subscribe button give a like to let me know that you like it and have a very happy merry christmas and i will see you guys next time bye